Here's what to expect when getting a custom built PC built by Scan Computers UK in 2021. So it's the 4th of March 2021, 8am. And I ordered a top end 5950X 64 gig RAM RTX 3080 PC on the 6th of January 2021. And Finally got a due date for dispatch on Monday the 8th of March at midday. So, they haven't got long, you know, they only got today and tomorrow unless they work weekends to get it built for dispatch, dispatch Monday. So what's the current status? Or shall I go through the specs of my PC quickly? Case, Meshify 2. Motherboard Asus ROG Strix X570 Gaming Processor of course the 5950X I paid 780 So it's gone down in price by £30 Cooler Corsair Hydro uh, 360mm Which you need for the 5950X 64 gig RAM £317 I paid a lot less uh, I think about something like £270 uh, graphics card, of course, it is going to be. Where is it? Graphics card is the Asus TOF RTX 3080. 850, I paid 750. So that's the bulk of the price increase over the past two months. Power supply 170. I think it's the same price I paid for it. Um, two solid state drives NVMe 2 Corsair 1 terabyte MP600. They are PCIe 4. Because <coughs> the motherboard I got is PCIe 4. Same price as when I paid for them. Operating system is Windows 10 Pro 162. I think I paid about 132 for it. You can get their licenses off eBay anyway for about £30, less than 30 And I think that's it. So that's my system. Uh, also, I should mention Scan building about £200 extra into the cost. But they do pay for other stuff. You know, what's needed like uh, paste on the CPU and uh, maybe some cabling some accessories that you need so there's that in there i don't know how much that cost maybe 20 30 pound so roughly 200 pound added on to the actual component price anyway this is where we stand at 8 a.m and it's a waiting build order taken 6th of january a waiting build so they said they're going to dispatch it Monday and it will Thursday, Friday be enough. So I'm going to monitor it over the next two days and update the process. Especially since they say it's a 24 hour burning. So is that going to be over the weekend then, isn't it? Mm. I suspect they'll build it tomorrow. Leave it burning Saturday or I don't know. Do they work weekends? Scan computers, do you work on weekends? If so, to what degree? I know you might have your shop open on a Saturday. But I'm sure you're going to take Sunday off. There's laws anyway. To, you have to close up on a Sunday. So it's basically Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Three days enough because they're going to package and dispatch it on Monday. It's now 2 p.m. And we have lift off. So they built it. And they're doing a the memory test. Next will be software installation, that's operating system. And then 24 hour burning. But they've started it, so it should be done on time. Unless something goes wrong with the build. So it's fourth, fifth, burning. Probably do nothing over the weekend, then post it uh, Monday midday and I'll get it Tuesday two three four five days 
Here's a quick update just before midnight. Still Thursday, 4th of March. No change from uh, afternoon update. So they've done the memory test and looks like they built it during the morning. Did a quick memory test and then left it for the next day to install the software and initiate the burning test. There's also an image here of what's that they, they, they take some photos, build photos, and it shows the components. Got the Asus Tough RTX 3080 gaming card, 1000 watt Corsair power supply, Corsair 360 millimeter fan, 5950x, MP1 terabyte NVMe, 1 terabyte NVMe. Uh, that's the memory. 64 gig and you got the ROG Strix uh, motherboard what's that behind uh, case isn't there is it now so it's 11 a.m. 5th of March and let's see if any update if they install the software I guess they've been open since 9 a.m. so we've had two hours let's press refresh and see what happens Ooh. You see that software is installed and they've initiated 24 hour burning. So, this message uh, if I log in at 9 am tomorrow, then it should still be doing the burning as well as for the rest of today. So, they're going to leave it uh, till Saturday midday for 24 hour burning. Uh, I did check earlier about an hour ago and there was no update so they must have only started you know, the burning test maybe in last 30 minutes so I guess at the earliest 10 30 a.m. so I'll tr check it at say 9 a.m. 9 30 a.m. before the 24 hours is up See if it is actually 24 hour burning or not. So uh, it's uh, Saturday morning just before 7 a.m. 6th of March. And I woke up to check the status and it's saying 24 hour burning complete. <laughs> it's not been 24 hours. And also quality controls complete as well. So 11 a.m. They roughly started at 11 a.m. yesterday. I think this burning test was uh, probably 12 hours, 6 to 12 hours in that region, rather than 24 hour. Maybe as high as 18, but it's definitely not 24 hour. Especially if they've already done quality control as well. So what, did they wake up, go to work at 6 a.m. And so that the burning test was complete. Yeah, and then they did, they've already done quality control now system built and then they're going to ship it monday so it's now after 5 p.m on the 6th of march 2021 and my 3235 pound system that currently costs 3379 let's see what the current status is with scan is it finished or what whoa system built Order complete. That means they've dispatched it. Whoa, let's see if they've updated any images. Whoa, we got more images there. That's one I'm already seeing. We got a burning test there. Ada 64. Um, so look, start it. It says 2 p.m. there. One hour. So it's a 24 hour burning, not one hour. And it ain't stress test the GPU. That's not good, is it? So according to this, the stress test was one hour. Burning test was one hour. Well, according to the one I'm looking at, it says one hour there. And it says 5th of March, 2 p.m. So they started at 1 p.m. And when I checked in the morning, it said the it was complete, so 
maximum I estimated was 18 hours. It might be just that they did it for one hour and they didn't stress test the GPU either. Anyway, let's have a look. 59 degrees, that's cool. That is good cooling. Under 100% load is 59 degrees. That is running very cool. So that's good. Pity they're not you stressing the GPU, then the temperature would go up, obviously. So I'm definitely going to have to test the temperature. What I'm going to use, I'm going to use a few Fermark. Yeah, the definitely, you know, when you get a new PC, stress test it. The CPU, you can stress test with Cinebench. The GPU is something like Fermark. It's free. You can just run it. Uh, you do a quick benchmark. And then you can stress test it for you don't have to do 24 hour maybe just 30 minutes 20 30 minutes is enough you know as soon as the temperature stabilized you can see and you see if there's any artifacts see this is a problem they've not stress test it properly i'm guessing an hour uh, maximum it would have been 18 hour given the timings you know when i checked 6 a.m they had finished so it might be 12 hour i'm guessing between 1 and 12 hours not 24 what else have we got we got a uh, hard drive yeah cnd one terabyte each yeah they're both nvme tools yeah we got uh what's wrong with this why is it not scrolling up that's the back plate yeah pretty standard it's not showing the gpu plate that why some reason they're not stressed anyway I'm just getting a bit paranoid now yeah yeah that's the back motherboard back plate not the GPU there's the GPU yeah what else can I see here so you got the right at the top which is good takes the hot air and expels it out got two intake fans here pulling air in you got extractor fan there pushing air out you got the CPU in, in here and you got the big RTX 3080 cord and you can see I chose the right case Messify 2 look at how much space there is you know some cases there's not enough space to put in the RTX 3080 and I hope they send me the drive base so I can put drives in here one two three four five probably got space for one two three four five I'm probably gonna put in well at least three don't know if these are gonna come in the way up here but there's plenty of space and they probably slot something under there as well in this uh, area so the build looks pretty clean straightforward they've not made any obvious mistakes that I can see you got the four memory sticks there out of the way uh cooling you know everything's as i would expect it to be as i would do it in fact i would not do it any different yeah it's good clean build yeah warning label with bubble wrap so they packed it obviously they dispatched it and here's the other side of the case so I just need the, they, got, they will send the dry bears, it'll be in the accessories box and all the rest. So it's done, dusted and dispatched. So I'm going to, expected date is Tuesday the 9th, but I could even get it Monday now. So their build is a three day process. They started on Thursday, what is it, Thursday the 4th when they did the awaiting build and build and memory test yeah and on Friday they did the software and the the software installation it showed and Saturday they'd done the finished the burning test because when I logged in it would be done it before during I don't know I'm guessing it, it was a 12 hour burning it might have been just one hour I'm guessing now and then today, Saturday, did quality control, system built and dispatched probably during the afternoon. So it's, they, they follow a three day process. And then they uploaded the images, which is good. 
is you know why didn't they stress test the GPU anyway it's done I trust scan look I bought from them before that's not they're gonna pass it's gonna pass fur mark no problem I trust them I've been buying from them since 2008 typically spend when I buy a new system two and a half thousand pounds this time I've spent three thousand two hundred and thirty five so you know if I didn't trust them I won't spend that much so it's going to be delivered so do subscribe for that video when we see it delivered and unbox it and take a look at it and then switch it on and see what we get in terms of temps so yeah we've got a good early indicator that the cpu runs cool obviously 360 millimeter rad we've got no idea about the gpu though